Hey, this is Dave with All Pro Web Tools. I'm going to show you a neat little trick called the Time Adder. Imagine that you have a coupon or a discount or a web page that says uh, limited time offer, um, sign up by this date. But you never know when somebody's going to be viewing that web page or viewing that email. Maybe it's an email auto response to a lead box that was filled out. And so maybe it'll be filled out on Monday, maybe it'll be filled out on Wednesday. And you don't know how to set that due date ahead. So for instance, if you wanted the due date to always be two days ahead of whenever they visit the web page, how would you do that? Well, that's what I'm gonna show you. So first I'm gonna show you how to do it with an email. So go here to email, view emails. And we have this coupon email here, it says save $15. Now this gets sent automatically when somebody uh, fills out the newsletter form, they get a, a free coupon. And you see here it says use this coupon code. But what I wanna do is I want to add a comment here. It says hurry this offer expires on. But I don't know what date to put because I always wanna give people five day lead time. So maybe they'll look at this email on a Monday and I can't just set it for a Friday because if they view it on Friday, then the coupon will have already expired. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go up here to widgets and I'm gonna scroll down to the time adder. Now that is a little widget code, automatically puts that in there for you. And you'll notice there's three digits here. There's a one, a zero, and a zero. The first column is the number of days ahead. The second column is the number of months ahead. And the third is the number of years ahead. So if I wanted to set this ahead by five days, I'll put a five in there. And then all I gotta do is hit the save button. And I'm gonna see a preview of what it would look like if I was to uh, receive this email today. So five days from today would be Wednesday, April 11th of 2018. Now, if I was to view this email tomorrow, it would say Thursday, April 12th, 2018. So it's automatically going to update. Now this works also on your website. So if you go to my web pages and edit a web page, we'll put this down here at the bottom. Offer expires on and I'm gonna go to widgets and I'm gonna do the time matter. Now I'm gonna go ahead and make it one year and one month ahead. I'm gonna hit save and then I'm going to preview the page. And here at the bottom, you can see that one year and one month from today will be Monday, May 6th, 2019. And that's how you automatically add time to your website or to an email.